Today I have another Zara haul for you guys and this one is a Zara sale haul. Now I didn't think that I would pick up anything from the sale at all because to be honest with you guys, even though I love Zara and you guys know that I do Zara hauls quite often here on my channel, um, I do find Zara a bit pricey and the sale, even though it's a sale, was still kind of expensive. So yeah, long story short, I didn't pick up a bunch of pieces, um, but I did pick out some good items that work well with my wardrobe and my style. And yeah, I wanted to share them with you guys before this sale was over, which, guys, I cannot believe I'm actually getting this video up in time because I didn't think it was gonna happen. Okay, so I'm just gonna stop rambling. Let's jump right into this video. Before we do that, if you're new here, welcome. My name is Angelique. I make new videos twice a week about luxury fashion, and if that is something you're into, you should uh, definitely hit that subscribe button down below. Okay, so I have a big ol' box. Here it is, um, right here. And I'm just gonna start pulling the items out like as they are in here. Uh, hopefully the box is not gonna fall down and we're not gonna have any uh, crazy things happening. Okay, so let's start off with the first item, which is this guy right here. And I'm so sorry that it's wrinkled, but I've actually already worn this and therefore I've washed it, which is why it's wrinkled. Now, I did wear this in my last video, which if you haven't seen that, I will definitely leave it linked down below. You should check it out. But um, yeah, I just could not say no to this top. It is so beautiful. As you can see, it is a one shoulder detail top and it has a little knot here in the front, which just looks really flattering. Um, it's just it's like the material of this is like very soft and kind of like almost like a bodycon situation, like where it like hugs your body really nicely, uh, but it's not too tight or anything. It's really, really comfortable. And I already know that I'm gonna be getting so much use out of this, especially like wearing it to work and stuff because this is so, like it's sophisticated, it's classy, but it's modern and it's trendy and it's cute at the same time, which I totally live for. And yeah, really am a huge fan of this shirt and or top. And I am so extremely happy that I got it on sale. I think it was $20. And then I also wanted to mention that it has a zipper in the back. Now this does run true to size. I got it in a size small and it fits absolutely amazing. Moving right along to one of my favorite pieces. And I, okay, so I don't remember like the prices of all of these items, but I know that there are like three pieces in here, maybe two pieces that were like seven or eight dollars, which incredible guys, incredible. I, I was really hunting for the deals. Like I didn't want to buy anything that was over 40 bucks because you know, I don't know. I just, I, I wanted to feel like I really like was shopping a good sale. Um, so the next piece that I picked up is this denim skirt. And number one, I picked it up because I really needed a denim skirt. I do have one, but it's kind of one of those denim skirts that flares out like towards the bottom. So I don't really know how to explain it, but yeah, it just kind of flares out a little bit. Um, so it's just cut a little different. And I wanted one that was just like a traditional denim skirt. And when I saw this, I thought it was perfect. I love that it looks um, like cut, like, well, it doesn't look, it is just like cut off and has a raw hem, which I really liked. And then also, of course, all the buttons, uh, the color, like the wash of it is really nice. And I definitely think it looks, it almost looks a bit like a Levi denim skirt if I do say so myself um, material like the quality of this denim is really nice and yeah really good denim skirt for the price that I got it for and this I did get in yeah also a size small and yeah it's super cute okay so this says $29.90 but I know that's not what I paid for it I think this might have been one of the items that was like eight bucks or something ridiculously cheap next I picked up a blouse that I thought would go really good with the denim skirt but also would be perfect for fall already thinking ahead guys already thinking ahead um and this is it right here it is so cute obviously very basic the colors are very neutral but i do love that it has um a little what do, what do you call that a tie string 
a string I don't know but anyways you can tie it around your waist and like cinch it in which I really liked because that's different from your typical button-up and yeah again the material like the quality on this I feel like is really nice it feels thick but it's soft and it just feels like it would be really comfortable I've not worn this yet so I can't say for sure um, size is also a size small and I, I don't know I just really like the colors and I thought this would be good for now but then also perfect for fall so could not pass this guy up and i don't know i think this was definitely like a really good find okay so this next item is one that i definitely wouldn't have picked up at full price not because it's not cute but more so because it's not something i would typically go for and it is this red sweater right here now you're probably thinking angelique it's a red sweater why wouldn't you why wouldn't you pick that up um i think it's just the whole vibe of it kind of the way it's cut it's a bit of like a bit more of like a boxier fit it and it's very relaxed and then it's red and then we have the little writing on the front um, just feels like something I usually wouldn't go for but when I saw this I thought it would look really cute with like a white button up underneath and have the collar sticking out or something maybe the sleeves showing I don't know I haven't tried it yet uh, so yeah that's why I picked it up and I also thought that this would be cute with maybe a skirt or maybe a pair of shorts and kind of just like tucking the sweater in uh, we'll see. I'll have to play around with it, uh, but it was really cheap. Now, one thing I did want to mention is that I do feel like on this particular sweater, you can definitely tell that the quality isn't there. It does feel really cheap, inexpensive, if you will, which isn't a bad thing. I mean, but I just thought I would let you guys know. Uh, and then also, I do think that it runs a bit small. I did pick this up in a medium because I wanted it to be a bit more oversized. So like I said, I could put like a button up underneath or something. However, the medium kind of fits like a small. So I wish I would have known that then I would have sized up even more. I feel like sometimes Zara's sizing is a bit weird. Uh, but yeah, so that is the sweater. And then I picked up something that I am so happy about, like so happy that I found. So let me, let me just, let me, let me grab it real quick. Here we are. So I picked up this long oversized green coat that has like two humongous pockets in the front. Now this coat originally cost, okay, let's see, I think $150, yes, $150 and I got it for, sorry guys, my, my cat just discovered the box on the floor. Um, so I got it for 40 bucks, which I thought was amazing. You know, we saved a lot of money on this guy. And I think this would be such, this will be such a statement piece for fall because it will, believe me, it will dress up and add something to any outfit. And I think that I'm going to be wearing this mostly with like monochromatic looks. Obviously I'm going to wear it with everything, but Again, I had a vision, um, like an all white outfit or maybe an all black outfit, all nude outfit, just like a monochromatic look and then throwing this jacket on because this color is so neutral, it's gonna go with anything, anything at all. Polka dots, uh, green and black stripes, wh whatever, whatever you can imagine this jacket's gonna go with. Uh, I just, I really love it and I'm so glad that I caught this. Now, I did get this in a size small and like I said, it's oversized. Definitely very, very oversized. But yeah, super cute. Uh, I love that it has lining on the inside. I feel like sometimes with Zara coats or jackets, they kind of are a bit cheaply made on the inside, like there's no lining, which I don't like that. <laughs> um, so I was really happy when this one came in and it did have like a nice lining and it, it feels pretty nice. It doesn't feel cheap or anything. Um, so yeah, I'm going to link a couple of videos right here. Make sure to check them out. Thank you guys so incredibly much for watching. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it and uh, I'll, I'll see you in my next one. Bye.